to, you can accomplish. Wards of the Boys Training Center were able to have some summer clinic us, activity, like numerous again. young people vacationing no, from school, no. as two of the island's accomplished tennis coaches put on a free clinic for the wards at the National Tennis Center. Gary Sweetnam, who runs an academy in Houston, Texas, and Hamlet Phillip, who has his own tennis and fitness academy in New York, returned to the island to teach the young wards the rudiments of tennis. The session ended with a talk to the participants on building and maintaining self-esteem. Sweetnam advised the wards that if they wanted to achieve anything in life, they need to have heart, desire and discipline. These kids, seeing what tennis involved, the fitness aspect, had them running, drilling, the discipline, understanding discipline is what they, they realized, they thought it would be a lot easier. But once, they, once we started dealing with a lot of technique and how to hit the ball, they could see how challenging it was. And uh, that, that, that being said, we haven't, I haven't actually completed it. We're going to have a little chat at the end to tell them, to talk to them a little bit about what it entails for us to be as good as we are through discipline. He called for continuity of such clinics and recommended that they should be given an opportunity to play tennis at least once a week. These kids need to know in life, of course, they've made some bad choices, but we all make bad choices. But knowing that if you apply yourself to whatever it is, education, in order for you to be successful, you have to be disciplined and you have to work at hard at it. And that's, that's the takeaway. Of course, if one of them continues playing tennis, that would be great. But if they all left knowing, hey, you know what? Discipline, that means I've really got to continue to do whatever I want to do and understand that uh, I, I have to respect rules, respect authority, and work hard at whatever I want to accomplish in life. That would be, that for me is an absolute success. Coach at the Boys Training Center, Alvin Xavier, noted that this was not the ward's first exposure to tennis as they served as ball boys and also officiated at junior tournaments before. He was pleased to have some level of formal coaching for the wards during the summer period. Well, it's a great initiative because some of the boys never played tennis before and they were just watching life one way. So when you open them to other different avenues, different sports, probably now something might spark in them and that might be their future because Coach Hemsley, which I haven't seen probably over 20 years, yeah. he was in football with me when I was a young son. Watch now, he's a, he's a professional coach. So even though your favorite sport might be football, but for your life and your career, it might be in another sport. Xavier said he realized the wards enjoyed the session and gained a positive outlook on life. He stated there was also a possibility of incorporating tennis at the center. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.